You see, I think that education should go along a development plan. Okay? You ask yourself, where do you think Ghana should be in, I don't know, five years' time? How do you get there? If you decide, oh, we are just doing reforms every year, since that is best time, Ghana has had about 14 reforms. Too many. Too many. So we don't even have time to implement, to, to review, to see whether it's working. And then somebody, you know, every time there's a new review, when you bring a new syllabus to the child in class one, one expects that, oh, by the time he starts working in, let's say, 10 or 15 to 20 years, you know where your economy should be, and that is why he's learning this now. We don't. We shouldn't do things because they are fanciful, because other people are doing it. Your economy is not where theirs is. So if you are not careful, you will be raising your own children into unemployment, because you haven't planned properly. If you have an economy where you are exporting your primary commodities, and you want to add value, what do you do? You look at what, what, what is working well and what is not. How do you add the value through education? Because, you know, no matter the, the resources you have, it's the people in the country who are going to make that resource, resources useful or not. So when we talk about education, we are talking about the human development. It's a very, very important area. And it has to be developed to what you know, to match something. If you live in a country where you have an aged population, you don't have the children. One country name was held, was it two years ago? They closed about 13,000 schools. Why? Because there were no kids. There were no children to go to those schools. And you, you have a youthful bulge. You have a high birth rate. And you want to do things like that country just looking at your population alone should tell you that's not the, the path I should be traveling. Otherwise, I have problems for myself. You see? So these are long conversations we need to begin to have. Have a proper plan. We did a 40-year plan. It wasn't for the fun of it. It wasn't for nothing that the AU did the 2063, the Africa we want. It, even UN has now started doing MDGs and SDGs. What should that teach us? So you see, my friends, we have a lot of work to do. And we need the female journalists to help us to do that.